All right, guys, in this brief video, I'm going to be showing you why most drop shipping stores fail. First off, when you come in, look at this. It's a mess. You have baby, automotive, home accessories, phone, assess phone accessories, women's fashion, men's fashion. What is this? Outdoors, pets, health. This is a mess. Nobody's going to buy anything from this website. And then even when you look at, all right, let's see. You look at the sim. No, there's no traffic. There's really no traffic coming in. Um, I went through. Let's see. You look at the apps. All right, you can see it's a Shopify store. Okay. Frameworks, Ruby on Rails. That's all of the typical stuff. All of this comes with it. Okay. Um, Cloudflare. And you can even see there's there's no real apps to even make anything better on here. This is this is overall crap. That's that's what this is. It's it's a mess. Um, let me see. And I mean, look at this. Wow, this is crazy. Then when you come down here, right? You come down here. There's terms of service, refund policy, shipping policy. There's no contact us. There's no about us. Those are two of the main things that most people, including myself, when I go to a, to a website, I want to look at the about us. I want to look at the contact us. Um, I want to know, you know, who is this company? And another thing. I mean, guys, get a Google voice number and put it on your website. So when people call, they don't have to get your real phone number, but there's a phone number that at least that that phone number can rank to your real phone. At least put that on there. There's, there's nothing. There's no way to contact them. This is this is pathetic. All right. Now, let's come in here. Let's let's just pick a category. OK, cat essentials. OK, now let's go into here. Let's let's go look at this. Okay, look at this. Fifteen okay, fifteen degree two blah okay, blah blah blah. Alright, we see some uh, measurements. Okay, okay. There's no it's not even a description. There's no dis how do you what the hell? How do you even how do you put this and there's no description? Alright, maybe maybe that was just this one. Let's Let's try women's fashion. Maybe, maybe there's a description in one of these because that cat thing. I don't even know why a cat and that. This is crazy. Um, I just got no. That, this isn't really. A, I mean, God, size. This is this is a terrible description. Normally, normally people have like a nice little description. You know, these beautiful shoes fit so well in the winter time. They look so. There's nothing. There's no. I mean, it just says the size. They don't really like. You know, I mean. Normally, people try to say something about the product to make you want to buy it, not just the size. Yeah. These images are just, that's, this is pathetic. All right, guys. So you've seen what it takes to um, make a terrible store. Um, terrible. Um, the first description, the first um, image, the, the cat thing, there was no description. This one has a terrible description. There's no apps to really enhance the uh, the um the experience of the customer. There's no about us. There's no contact us. This is just this is this is somebody who's just wasting money monthly. And I they could take that twenty nine dollars that they're spending on this and you can go do a lot of different things. But this this is this is just gonna fail unless unless they do something miraculous to turn this around i other than that i see i see nothing i see no one by i, I mean when you have places like fashion nova that like they perfect this and there's so many other clothing stores why why would you buy from the store why it, it gives me it gives me no incentive to buy and and when you and when your store is this crappy you really want to put a phone number so people can call you but guys please don't do this don't do not do this. Add a nice description and uh, and get you some apps, some upsell, some apps to help you upsell some apps. Just just some apps to help your business. This is pathetic. But um, and, and add about add a nice about us and add a contact. All of my websites, I put a phone number so people can call me. I like when people call me. It's, you know, it helps the business. But people nowadays, they hide behind websites. At one time, every I don't care what business it was. Everybody had a phone number. Nowadays, people try to hide. They don't want you to call them. It's, I don't know. It's a new day, but this is pathetic. And don't do this, guys. This is why uh, not just dropshipping stores. This is why any store fails okay any store doesn't matter if you're buying inventory and you're selling your own or if you drop shipping. it does not matter this is pathetic don't do it
Thank you. Hit the like button and I'm out.